Previously I took apart this old rickety footstool or dressing stool and managed to get most of it back together. Today I get rid of some tooth marks, repaint some of the faux finish, bear in the legs and have a look at the old seat. Now what I found is uh, that the finish was worse uh, than I first thought, so I'm having to rub back virtually to bare wood here. And what I'm going through is a paint finish, a faux finish uh, for the grain. Um, this is beach originally, it doesn't have an awful lot of character on it when it's plain. So what they've done is they've painted some grain in there, painted a figure on there and then covered it in shellac. So what I'm going to have to do is replicate that. So I'm, I shall sand back through everything that's loose and get uh, some colours out and try and match in with what they've done before. Now some of the furring blocks require a bit of attention as well. Um, particularly this one, what I'm going to do here is um, just file away some material and make that a nice fair curve uh, rather than try to fill in on that uh, sharp edge. And also some of them require a little bit of touch up to get the colours right. Starting with lighter colours we can gradually build up um, the figure to try and match the old that's on there. It's quite, it is a tricky business, uh, I'm not particularly good at it, I haven't done it an awful lot, but uh, we shall get there. The leg wings were reattached, not forgetting to put some wax on the screws. Where I had to repair some damage, I needed to refair the wings into the legs. Turning my attention to the seat pad, it's, uh, it's a little bit worn. Uh, I was going to just discard it, but I thought I would try to um, revive it a bit first of all. Uh, the worst that can happen is it's a bit of wasted time. So I'm gonna try and get that off without damaging it anymore, and then try and clean it. And you can see it's been tacked around the edge of a board, and then another board applied on top. So I'm actually gonna remove this board below first and see what's underneath. And those have been nailed from the other side, so actually I'm going to have to take the board, have to take the seat off first, so let's try and lift these tacks. The seat pad and the seat base are pretty much rubbish, so I'm going to chuck those away. The top, well, I'm going to try and save it by cleaning it off with some very mild detergent, see what I can do. Join me next time when I complete the repair.